13 WMAC weather sponsored by Premier Heating and Air. Thank you for 607 this morning. I just love the whole winter in the morning thing, fall by mid morning, spring in the middle of the day and then back to winter at nighttime. Is this Central Georgia weather for you in a nutshell? Pretty yeah. much. <laughs> and about, uh, I don't know, like four days when like summer somewhere in between uh, yeah, and all of that. Um, no, just wait for April because we'll do this, you know, like start off in the 30s and then like make it to 80 in the afternoon. <laughs> and then it's like back to the 30s and then back to 70. It's just, it's. Welcome to Georgia. Here we go. All right, so temperatures there in the 30s this morning, but as Frederick alluded to, we're going to do a 30 degree temperature swing today. A light wind out of the west northwest at about three miles an hour, making it feel a couple degrees colder. 61 with sunny skies across central Georgia today. I will take that over what we had yesterday and the day before 35 in Forsyth, 39 in Crawford County this morning. Walking out the door in Jasper County, looking at about 38, 36 in Gordon, 41 in Dublin, 34 in Eastman, and 38 in Rochelle. Here's the radar picture. We're not seeing anything, not expecting to see anything. Yesterday made it to 52 after an overnight low of 37, so we're colder this morning than yesterday morning. We're going to get warmer this afternoon. Average high is about 61. We are up 1.21 inches of rain on the year through the day today. Not expecting to see much in the way of cloud cover mid 50s or so by the noon hour, upper 50s and low 60s later on today. I expect to get to about 61 here in Macon. We know how it goes this time of year. Got to add a couple degrees onto a feature view to get your high temperature and then back down near freezing for tomorrow morning before we're back near 60 again for tomorrow afternoon. Kind of a carbon copy day today to tomorrow. Then on Thursday, we begin to introduce some more clouds. We'll call it partly cloudy across central Georgia on Thursday as temperatures find their way even warmer. Let's get on in here to the end of the week and talk about the weekend because this is where things get a little messy. Saturday, 5 p.m. This is the GFS model here. See some rain just to our northwest beginning to move into central Georgia. That's going to be Saturday night into Sunday. This is Super Bowl Sunday here. That continues into Monday, it looks like. The GFS's counterpart, the European model, has something similar. So this is the same time frame, just a different model we're looking at now. Showers beginning late in the day on Saturday, lasting into Sunday, and then into Monday as well. This would be the wetter solution here. We could pick up two to three inches of rain if the European model comes true here. But uh, still some time to watch it as we get closer to the weekend. As things shape up now, though, I do think Saturday is going to be the drier day, a 40% chance of rain. Then on Sunday, a 60% chance of rain and I'm expecting that rain chance to go up here in the days to come. But that's going to be all day on Sunday. That's not going to be the morning or the afternoon. It's, it's going to be both of them and then likely into the night into Monday as well. So Saturday, I'm thinking later in the day for the, uh, the, the bulk of the rain chance, but then Sunday is going to be all day there. So if you're planning on throwing a Super Bowl party or anything down that lane, you're going to want to be inside for that one, not going to want to be outside. As for today, though, warming through the 40s, the 50s, eventually into the 60s later on this afternoon. And I really do think a couple hours this afternoon could be spent in the 60s. It's not just, you know, like a touch it and go back down. It could be like a more of like a play plateau, if you will, in terms of the temperatures, and then we get down into the 50s. So the temperatures again running warmer than we were yesterday. Sunny skies, winds out of the north northeast at 5 to 10. Sunrise at 726 this morning. City by city, everybody right around that 60 degree mark. 62 in Irwinton today, Milledgeville, 59 in Wrightsville, 60 in Eastman, 60 in McRae, 61 in Rochelle, and 62 over in Montezuma this afternoon. And then for tonight, 32, another cold start for your Wednesday morning. 63 there on Thursday with clouds on the increase and that warming trend continuing into the weekend. 73 on Saturday, 70 on Sunday as rain builds into central Georgia.